Okay, weight loss advice that I disagree with as a health coach and someone who's lost over 35 pounds and kept it off at for a number of years. Uh, the advice that I disagree with is specifically for around the holidays. I feel like there are two schools of thought. I feel like one is that we need to avoid everything. You can't eat or drink anything or we're going to we're going to gain weight, we're gonna go off track, we're gonna lose it all. I feel like the other side is that we need to just forget all of our healthy habits and eat and drink everything because it's the holidays, that's what we should do. And I actually got some comments last, last year on some of my videos that I was talking about still maintaining some of our healthy habit, habits saying, well, that's not the normal thing to do. And I completely disagree. And what where I fall and when I work with clients, when I'm talking family, friends, and everyone else is I feel like we, we could be somewhere right in the middle if we choose to. And in my opinion, that is is the best place to be as someone who has been all or nothing and all over the place in all of those categories it is where we can truly m maintain momentum maintain consistency and not feel like we have to start all back over in january because we have gone the all or nothing approach and it still allows us if we choose to to be able to eat and drink some of our favorite things around the holidays now i think the challenge with that sometimes is is sometimes we have one or two cookies or drinks or you know maybe a whole meal or a whole couple meals of things that are normally on our plan or considered healthy and then our brain gives us all the reasons that we need to just throw it all out the window because we blew it. And that is the key right there, is acknowledging and becoming aware of those thoughts that we, we are being fed by our brain, because really what it's trying to do is get us to keep eating those things, drinking those things, and not exercise, because that's harder, and catch on to that, and be aware of that, and decide to talk back to it and remind it that, no, we're, we can have those things one time, and then we're still gonna get back on track the very next morning. Every single year, every single holiday, I practice this, and let me tell you, it works. And the other thing is sometimes the day after Christmas morning, I am not feeling the best because I am eating things that I don't normally eat and more of them, but I am still getting to the gym. I am still working out if it's not getting to the gym, going for a walk, whatever it is, even though I do not feel great because I know that I'm moving back in the direction that I want to be and getting myself back to feeling where I'm going to feel my best. So if you have any questions on this, drop them below. If you're interested in working together, there's a link in my bio. You can book a free consultation call or you can grab one of my free downloads.